Welcome Divine Masculines to Royal Phoenix Rise and I hope all is well with you all. My name is Sekhmet Carter for those who do not know. The daughter of Ra, aka also known as the past leader of the Hebrew Israelite community, Benami Carter. Welcome to Royal Phoenix Rising. I will be giving you a brief reading for the next 24 hours. What do the Divine Masculine has to look forward to for the next 24 hours? Let's go. Divine Masculine, you're so fine. I gotta give it to you. You're so fine. Um, hold on a second. These parts. One second. Let me just shuffle this right. I feel that the Divine Masculine, I feel that you are mirroring the Divine Feminine. You all should watch the, the reading of the Divine Feminine. Watch that reading. It's going to resonate. Wait, hold on a second because these cards, they are not in the right. Who these flies are so ignorant today? divine masculine you are becoming more spiritually evolved you are becoming more serious about spirituality you are stepping into your autonomy as a divine masculine as well as the divine feminine is check out the divine feminine reading you are mirroring the divine feminine you are are now discovering your superpowers. You all are discovering your super abilities, your gifts, your talents, you are discovering. You are developing a stronger relationship with the divine spirit of life, which many people call God. I don't use the term God because God is the devil. Technically. Okay. Another story for another time. Check out my reading for the Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine blood type. O minus RH negative. I briefly explained there. Now, Divine Masculine. You are making a very difficult decision. And... This decision consists of your spiritual beliefs, what you believe. You have recently been enlightened with information regarding spirituality. And now you are making a very difficult decision whether to believe this information or not. I'm here to tell you that the information that you encountered is true. It could be my video that y'all came across. It could be my video that y'all came across. But the information that you've encountered that has you thinking, rethinking your religious beliefs, your spiritual beliefs, I'm sorry, your spiritual beliefs, 
that has you rethinking your life in general, it is true. Now, there could have been some conflict in the past, in the recent past, there has, there has, there has been some conflict, there could have been some conflict with you and several other people. And you realized how not only that you are chosen, but you realize that those people will never ever understand your view, how you view life, your perspective of life. They will never ever understand these things. Why? Because they are not chosen like you. They showed themselves to you, who they truly are. They revealed themselves to you, who they truly are. And a part of the decision as well is whether to cut them out of your life or to move forward. You will know intuitively, this is your path. On this channel, you will learn how to follow your intuition. I will give you no answers. I will always, always, Request of you to follow your intuition. Your intuition is your super power, your higher self, your higher guidance, as many people would say. You are following your intuition in the season. You are becoming enlightened with a lot on your path. And as I mentioned in the previous reading, in the, as, I, as I mentioned previously, check out the reading of the Divine Feminine. And I believe that applies to you as well. I believe that, that it applies to you as well. This one card wants to come out so badly. <laughs> the sun. <laughs> The sun. So you are stepping into a season, baby, where you cannot lose even if you try. After this period that you've experienced, the sun is going to shine. After this storm, the sun is going to shine. You're currently experiencing some sort of setback. And you're going to overcome these setbacks. No doubt. I'm going to stop the reading here. As I mentioned, this is a brief reading. Thank you all for joining me. Until next time. I say.